in this video we are going to discussing about lead time in Odoo 13. So what is lead time? Lead times are nothing but the time expected to receive delivery or manufacture the product. One can configure the lead time for purchase, sales and manufacture. The vendor lead time is a time demanded by the vendor to deliver a product. On the other hand, customer lead time denotes the time needed to delivering a product to the customer and the manufacturing lead time the time needed to manufacture a product and let's take a look on purchase lead time here inside the purchase module we have the product tab inside the product by selecting a product Here, the product type is storable and inside the product purchase tab here we have the vendor and inside the vendor here we can see the delivery lead time for this product it's 8 day since the delivery lead time is 8 when you make a purchase order the order date will be 8 day before the combined to the scheduled date and we can check it by making the purchase order for this product by this vendor inside the purchase order we creating a new purchase order for this we specifying the vendor wood wood corner and the product is caustic and by confirm and here inside the by saving this and by clicking the order line here we can see the schedule date is 27 8 days is added with the confirmation date and this is what the vendor lead time or the purchase lead time and here we can set the security lead time for purchase inside the settings configuration settings we can enable the option for security lead time for purchase by enabling the option here security lead time for purchase here we can specify the date or the day lead day here here we specify 2 then trigger the run scheduler the RFQ will be sent to the corresponding vendor if the quantity on hand is the minimum that set it in the schedule and since the security lead time is 2, the order date will be 2 day before the current date. And next is security lead time for sales. By enabling this, here we can see a select purchase. We have the option for specifying the lead date here. Here I specify 2 here. Then saving the page configuration page then while making the sale order here lead time is 2 so the scheduled date will be 2 day before expected date we can check that inside our sale module set the sale module ordering the product Creating and doing specifying a customer and selecting a product here. Here selected bolt and confirm. And here in the delivery tab, we can see the scheduled date is before. 
two day before the confirmation date it's 70 and the order date is in 90 so this is how we setting security lead time for sales and the next is customer lead time for that inside a product here we have here we have the inventory tab inside the inventory tab here we can see customer lead time by clicking the edit button we can specify our customer lead time here as two days while making a sale order here customer lead time is two so the expected date will be two day extra of the confirmation date and the schedule date will be the same as we discussed and we can see that while make a sale order for this inside of our sale module here we can create a new sale order for that and by clicking create button specify a customer and the product is bold we selected the product and after save and confirm and here inside the other informations while we'll drag it down here we can see the delivery date expected date is two day added it's 21 90 plus 2 it's 21 this is how we specifying or create configuring customer lead time and while selling two products with different customer lead time for example here bolt and our acoustic is both are different in lead times and when you make sale order for those product uh, there comes two shipping policies we have we can see that show the demo here we can see inside the other options or other informations we can see the shipping policies here as soon as possible and when all products are available and we selected when all products are ready in the case the expected date will be the maximum date compared with the product lead time and if it's according to the as soon as possible here the expected date will be take the minimum date compared with those two product lead time and we we can get that if we choose the two shipping methods and that's all for customer lead time and next is manufacturer lead time as like the customer lead time inside the product here we can see the option inside the inventory here we can see the option manufacturing lead time if we specify here the lead time as to <coughs> the manufacturing lead time is 2 so the deadline start will be 2 day before the expected date and after finishing the manufacturing order the delivery date will be changed to 2 days extra to the expected date those we can change the different lead time in order i think 
you understand this and thanks for watching this video if you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any odu implementation or customization in your business drop your request to info@cybrosis.com